Legacy, that's her. Yeah, it seems like with a lot of these costumes, the problem is that she loses her identity. Yeah. Which is a problem. Now, that one's really freaking cool, but it shows a lot of skin, but it's still yeah, really freaking cool. I know, but it's yeah, that's super her cool. That's her default outfit. That's like the iconic one. That's well, her. of course it is, that, that's it's the her. one that looks good. <laughs> that's her. I actually don't... I don't like that design very much. Well... Like her default outfit? I think it. it's just... Okay, but it's this weird. is the one we're kind of thinking about, right? Yeah, that's Electronica. So Electronica with I actually, goggles. I actually like that one quite a bit. Just because of, like, the weird... See, like, the two-texture thing yeah. that's going on in the chest? Mm -hmm. Although, the more I thought about it, and the more I compared it to other outfits, because there's a lot of, like, reuse of, of um, different parts of the models, mm -hmm. I think that might actually be her bra. Mm. Like, exposed yeah, on the I left side. Yeah, I think so. I think so, too. Or what... what I, she probably doesn't actually have any, like, definitive undergarments under all of these. It's probably, like, just the outfit and what's built into it. Mm -hmm. So she's probably... I don't think anybody would wear a bra with that outfit, you know? Mm-hmm. So that's probably just what passes. Gosh, I'm not really sure how I would describe the male version of this. Hmm. I think it could probably be structured sort of similarly, but instead of showing, like, the... the it would probably be, <clears> like, <throat> really tight pants and an open shirt instead. That's what I was thinking. Yeah, me too. Okay, well, I guess we thought of it. So, hang on, let me start the episode. <laughs> oh, shoot. Mm. <laughs> Actually, I don't know. Bail, maybe put just some of that in? I don't know. Today, Precarious Plays... Samurai Legend Musashi. Ah... <sighs> So yeah, I, I, we looked up. We looked up a picture of specifically Electronica. It wasn't the one I was thinking of. The asymmetrical one. It's it's the green one that you get very early on. I think it might be like the first alternate outfit you get. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Famous samurai. I got the sword of one. half an hour again. Does this does this world only function? On units of well, half an hour? They didn't want to say 20 minutes. They didn't want to say 30 minutes. No, fucking, I want them to be like 23 minutes and 19 seconds later. See, she's... You took she long knows what's enough. Up. She's got fancy <clears throat> sleeves, too. Gotta love the fancy sleeves. Speaking of fancy sleeves, I think that if a boy... Like, was going to try to approximate, like, a masculine... <laughs> Does she have panic face? Yeah, she looks worried. She's like, I'm not good at this shit. <laughs> she did uh, a panic face. That was pretty funny. Yeah, that was pretty cute. <clears throat> and it's cool. I didn't remember the sword being her sword. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> maybe she. Oh, maybe that's it. Maybe she just starts using a spear in the the arena. Maybe that's why I remember her yeah, with the spear. Yeah, so she gives you hers. <clears throat> Zephyr, wind, gale, typhoon. Chows. Oh, that's why I didn't remember it. It's because it transforms as soon as it's unlocked. Oh. Not a katana anymore. That's okay. pretty cool looking. Now I can use Hurlwind. Okay, but I just wanted to talk about my male raver outfit that I imagine, but that's okay. We can just talk about your silly sword. So here's the main problem I have, because I'm getting into it now. Yeah. We've been talking about this on and off for a few episodes, but the more I think about it, like we took a break and I was like, why am I like, why am I like pretty so bothered? Pretty bothered. And I remembered Final Fantasy 13 did have a character that relied on their clothes for their power. Yeah. It was fucking Snow! <laughs> snow put on different jackets with different emblems on, on his back. Uh -huh. And drew like that was his weapon. It was his jacket his emblem. Jacket emblem. Like you remember the the badass like super huge tall warrior with the bandages and the white outfit in Baroni Kenshin. Yes. And like bad was written on on the back. Yes, I love him. It like bad or naughty or like badass. Yeah. Whatever was written on. Or maybe just ass. <laughs> Or maybe ass. just hot ass. <laughs> he was so cool. <laughs> Whatever was written, it's the same The same deal. Yeah. Whatever emblem was written on his back. Snow would draw power from it. On the back of his jacket. So he did have to play dress up. He just didn't have to take so much off. 
Well, no, he was already he was always pretty fucking naked because he didn't wear a shirt. That motherfucker just wore a, a long coat. I know. Maybe fucking that's why doof. I'm remembering him so fondly. Now that now that I think about it, I feel like I've seen his abs a lot. Mm, yeah. Anyways, but no, I think that instead of instead of doing the tight top tiny bottom situation that yeah. lightning has, I think it would be like tight bottom tiny top. So like maybe like a sleeveless vest that was not uh, you know what kind of like what snow wears but without sleeves <laughs> and then like really tight pants in in contrasting colors and textures maybe with some like mesh accents definitely like one of those dorky bracelets like those leather bracelets Oh, yeah. Yeah. For that outfit. And I, t I have to tell you, I don't like Lightning's outfit very much, but I don't like the male version. I don't like the idea of the male version of that one either, but I think you just have to be into certain things to, to just, like that. Just trying to, to make everything fair. There yeah, are... I feel like that would, that would do it. I feel like that would work. There are a handful of outfits in there that I think are, are pretty ugly. Like mm -hmm. one recurring one. You that you get, you like, in its most stripped-down version, mm -hmm. I think it's fine. But what they do with that game, they have, like, a lot of different parts that get get matched up differently to create new new outfits, right? Mm-hmm. And... One of the things, one of there's there's one edition of this this style of outfit that they just put all of the shit on it, right? Yeah. They just added more and more stuff, and they they took an okay outfit and then just ugh. just like put so much excess on it. She looks like she just like put all of her other outfits from that game into a pile and then just rolled through it a few times. And it's got like one big doofy feathery arm, which I think I talked about liking before. In this particular one that I'm imagining now, it's not cool because it's like it's the, the pushes it over over the edge too much. Yeah. So I think that Final Fantasy and it's really Final Fantasy 13 Lightning Returns has moments where like Fang joins you temporarily mm -hmm. from Final Fantasy 13. Yeah. She's cool. I think that they could have just. Story-wise, they could have just sort of found a way to, like, switch Snow and Hope, effectively. Mm -hmm. And Snow could have just been with you the whole game mm -hmm. instead of, of any of the other characters. And it could have just been a cool, like, buddy cop thing. Yeah, where they would like go suit up together. That would be so fun. Oh my god, and then you I want to play that. You, you'd have... You'd, <laughs> You would just control one of them at a time. Yeah, I guess. And <sighs> yeah, so I think that Snow could have just been your companion the whole game. Mm -hmm. And Square Enix could have used some of their money to. Just have a, a cool game where it's like, yeah, we built the whole thing around stupid fucking sex appeal, but we included one of our, our sexy eye candy boys. So yeah. th that's, another, that's one of the other things that bothers me is that whenever I played Final Fantasy 13, Snow always felt like sort of like dumb sex appeal. Yeah. Especially since... I mean, he seems like a nice guy. Okay, well, the thing is that they pair him up with Sarah. Right, so his whole his, his whole his story... Whole reason for being there is because somebody cares enough to, you know, bone him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Marry because, him, yeah. Right, because they're, they're, they're engaged. engaged. Yeah. I forgot about that part. That's the only reason he's there. He just rises to the occasion, you know? Yeah, so... Like he really does. It's nice. I, I just my my head is filled with really like cool images where 
you you'd have like a, a Reno and Rude moment where they both like start out a cutscene and they both just have like matching suits on. Yeah. Like matching like dark dark suits, just very standard white Maybe. white under black outer suits. Doesn't Lightning have a chocobo outfit? I Didn't don't... she have like a fluffy chocobo outfit, or am I just imagining that one? Somebody in the game has a fluffy chocobo outfit. I don't know if Lightning has access to the same one. Yeah, but I'm just kind of like what you're describing. I'm kind of imagining like um, a Reno and Rude walking together moment, but of course it's Lightning and Snow instead, and then like they're. Out, like they continue to stride forward, but their outfits flash through changes. Yeah, and it's like, and you can't tell by the way I use my walk. I'm a woman's man. <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> look, the potential, the potential is great because you can have, you can have like a really like a serious one where they're both like in proper fucking battle armor. Yeah. And then you can have like a goofy fan service one where- Where like she's dressed like a chocobo and he's dressed like a little woofy. Oh shit, actually I think Cloud, she had Cloud's armor. Yeah. And it would have been <laughs> awesome if um, sh if uh, Snow had been Tifa. Yeah, Tifa and Tifa's shit, like a Tifa yeah. outfit for, for him. <laughs> and he could have, she could have a Cloud outfit. See, like, the potential for this is so high. Why couldn't they have included him? Why did they have to just, you know? Like, faff about, it just, it feels, in hindsight, the whole costume switching mechanic just feels really vapid and very, 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 very fan y And that was almost certainly, like, the intention but it doesn't, it didn't have to be. Well, and that the other thing is that it feels like, okay, so it's fan service -y, right? Am I not a fan? Ha! You know? Well, no, you're not. I guess not. Not, not, not in their mind. That's one That's of the other the problems. Problem. Yeah. That's the problem. You know? Because, and, and the, 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 I want to the, play dress up with snow now. I don't want to the whole game, just to dress up snow. I... I'm I want to make to... paper dollies and put snow, put different outfits on snow. <laughs> I I want to play dress up paper dolls with snow just as much as I as I did with lightning. Yeah, that's true. Well, me too. I mean, that's the thing. There are so many opportunities for me to dress up like lady people because it's you know I don't feel like I need more of it. But dang it, do I want to put new sunglasses on snow? Like, imagine how many different pairs of sunglasses that motherfucker could use. Lightning has, like, if you include, if you exclude the, the palette swaps, Lightning still has, like, nine pairs of sunglasses in that game, I think. Yeah. $900 sunglasses. For everyone. Do you have anything else you want to say? Because I I hope that we don't... I want to dress up like lightning. No, no. I want to dress up like snow dressed up like lightning. Dr <laughs> dressed up like r rude. <laughs> dressed up with Reno's hair. Can we do that? Can we do that? You'll have to you'll have to sketch it out because I you lost me around. I don't remember what I said. We were recording this, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay. 